is my peace resembling death. A chamber through which light had once shown lies now a mangled husk of muscle and bone. Lovely light blue, your eyes once reflect the sulking shroud of death's soul. Winter chills dry skin, a feast of a blight restlessly shuddering as you lie your last night. Floral patterns dance along the walls in your dress, so tragic a life to be stripped its fluoresce. The clock strikes your time, heart wretches despair, fragile and delicate the strands of your hair, tattered and defiled. Dirt tracks through your clothes, scattered red stains from the blood, I suppose. Infested with maggots, muscles let not a quiver, mind drenched in black, but another body in the river. Flowers that wilt dead, shrivel in the cold, skin yellow green, the rotting stench of mold. Candle burned bright with time that extinguished, bones slit, flesh affected, gangrene distinguished. <laughs> um, Twisting tendons, bloom and obscene putrefaction, a mangled vestige of art, the purest abstraction, the raw chill of wind caresses your skin. How pretty I know before you must have been. The ticking of a clock, the echo of a bell, when I shake the hand of death, I'll gladly greet you in hell. Life without pain exists only in thought. Infinity and oblivion, eyes ring, blood shot. Beings of hate, incurable of our vice, hell or release through death, our device, advice of intricacy and artistic intent, the tigers of life in its horrific descent. Rust festers cages of blades and bloody wire, a vulgar sight to have seen, for none to admire. The depraved bleed in harmony, and yet all lie alone, the dancing of the damned, the sins for which they atone.